Hey, it's Dave2. In my last video, I said that I would try and listen to some binaural beats and see what it does to my brainwaves. I know a bunch of people use this pure theta waves track, uh, this one right here. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to turn this on and listen to it for a little bit. It's two hours long, so I'm not going to listen to it for the whole thing. And we are going to see what it does to my brain activity. So hopefully this stays on. I'm going to toss this guy on, um, which I always do, which is a Manta eye mask. And let's see what happens. So ideally, this theta waves thing, if the binaural beats is working, it should go up. And currently, theta is on the bottom. It's that purple one. So let's see what happens. I'll do a little three, two, one to count down when I'm starting, which I believe I can turn it on with um, this. So let's try it out. It'll be fun. Uh oh, I don't remember where I put the headphones. There they are. And three, two, one. And it's going. I will link to this track in the uh, description as well as a comment. And in my mind, I'm just going to try and just clear it. And we'll just go to the workspace and just kind of sit there. So, all right, I'm in the workspace. Kind of just sitting here. I'll say any impressions that I get, if I do get any. But I'm not going to request any. Or listen. had a spike in neural activity there. So if you see something, just me thinking, it's gone. Turn the volume slightly down. A little more subtle.
real curious to see if it's doing anything. Let's try and go out of body real quick. Doing my body scan right now. No longer fill my body in Maba. Moving that awareness above my head. Seeing the room. Going up, looking down. I see the roof of my house, my neighborhood, larger city, more of the city. Going to turn and reorient north south. See the earth. Let's go to the moon. There's the moon. Let's try and do something interesting. Let's go to an active site on the moon. Okay, I found a location. My brain hurts right now. I'm not going to reball for this. Found a circular like structure moving into it. That was fun. All right, let's zoom out. There, going outside of the galaxy. Well, outside of the solar system, past the Oort cloud, looking back out of the galaxy. This is way beyond what I said I was going to do for this video. Going to the center of the Milky Way, wrapping around the center, coming back. There we are again, going through the Oort cloud, past all the planets. They're still relatively lined up, that's cool. There's the Earth and the Moon. Come back down, down, down. Down. There's my state, city, neighborhood zooming in, coming to the top, see my spot, coming to the roof, floating down through the ceiling, coming back down, aligning my body state, merge. Now we're just sitting in these theta waves, but I did feel like some beta activity. Feeling nice and loose. This is a good track. It gets you feeling the vibrations. I like it. So hopefully this stayed on the whole time. And let's see what it got. Oh, there we go. Hopefully it got some interesting stuff and we will see what it was. That was about nine minutes, 48 seconds, turning that off. So I will check the feed on this and maybe there's some cool stuff. Very high in Delta, Theta did come up, which is good. 
my brain's just the delta brain so all right hopefully this adds some clarity to some of the brainwave stuff i did the technologies of uh eg and pemf or eg i did use a manta eye mask which is kind of like my staple here for blacking out that's probably why i get into that delta dominance and yeah that's another way that you can go about uh, forcing a brain state so that'd be equivalent to the pemf device i kind of if you're gonna do it i would do it in um cooldown i would use pink noise and only for the cooldown not during a session but that's just me so thanks i just took a quick look it looks like i was mostly an alpha the whole time followed by delta beta was right there and like theta slightly came up so does that like i now i'm wondering if it even did anything or if like like what was what was it doing you know if it didn't actually force my brain to theta one of my things with pmf is how do i validate that my brain's in that i can't like toss on the eeg and this at the same time maybe i could um maybe i should do a video on that but yeah I, I really don't know like i get the vibrational sense it feels good it feels like something's happening but i don't necessarily know if anything is really going on there that i can't just do through normal meditative techniques so i would say that test was inconclusive it did not show a theta spiking above the rest which is what that is supposed to do, or at least for for that one track. I will say that I enjoy listening to that track and I do feel super vibey and I, I feel like the womp 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 vibrations, which is great. And I'm gonna keep listening to it. <laughs> but is it having the, uh, the same effect that you think that Binaural Beats has? I don't think so. So food for thought.